Mann Middle School Band Director Amber Moore is making history by becoming the first woman to lead the Abilene High School marching band. KTAB's Ashley Ibarra found out what intrigues more about music and working with young people and what she's looking forward to most in leading Texas's oldest marching band. Amber Moore is making history. But I'm really excited to now be kind of the name of getting to push through the barriers here in Abilene ISD and show what a woman can do. By becoming the first woman to head direct the Abilene High School Eagle Band. So I get to have an active role in both of my feeder middle schools, both Craig and Mann. So I will be teaching on both campuses. I'll get to interact with kids for seven years now. Jude Olson has been in band learning from Moore for three years now but says he was overjoyed when he heard the news since he's planning on joining the Eagle Band. So I was like, I'm so excited because Miss Moore, I mean, she like, she taught me everything I know. Like, she is the person, she's the one that taught me and she's just amazing. Elena Curley first met Amber Moore when she was a student teacher at Mann Middle School. I'm super excited for her to be at Abilene High, I can't say enough nice things about her. Now she works with the Abilene High School Band, where she will work alongside more. Now that she's going to be on our campus, I just know that I'm going to continue to learn a lot from her, and all of our kids are just going to flourish under her direction. Moore says with her new role, she hopes to reach more students. Music is, yes, what I teach, but it's also how I teach. So I'm really fortunate that I get the opportunity to teach life skills to kids every day with a medium in which is just so special. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Ashley Ivara, KTAB News. Thank you, Ashley. Moore says she has already started taking an active role in her new job. Best of luck to her. Band director certainly making a difference in kids' lives. I remember my band director, Joe Mack Hill.